August 31st, 2007, the day where it all began. And today is 12 a.m. right now, and it's August 17th, 2011. On that day, August 31st, 2007, I watched the very first episode of Phineas and Ferb, which is the sneak peek on YouTube in English. When I was 13 years old, when I was a fan of Foster's Hole for Imaginary Friends, Camp Laszlo, Cat Scratch, or Chud and Cyrus, or the fan and series of Phineas and Ferb, or SpongeBob. And I got into one of my favorite shows, Phineas and Ferb. And then after that, that day changed my life forever. And then, four years later, we got the new movie, which I'm super hyped to see it on opening day in two weeks on, in cinemas. And it's my most anticipated movie of all time, and I can't wait to see it in two weeks on the day when it comes out. Hey guys, it's Fierce Fun Sponge Fan 1094 once again. I mean, hey guys, it's Fierce Fun 1094 here. And I have to say, guys, happy fourth anniversary to my favorite Disney show of all time also known as Phineas and Ferb. Like holy cow, I cannot believe it's been four years since I first watched Phineas and Ferb for the very first time. And it's been four years since the show first came out on Disney Channel. And I cannot wait, and I cannot believe how popular this show is and it's one of the most iconic Disney Channel shows of the new, of the modern ages. And it's one of the most popular Disney cartoons. And it changed Disney Channel forever. Holy crap. And if you guys remember, I always wanted a Phineas and Ferb movie when I watched the show back in 2000, back in those years. But then, this year, my wish has came true. And also, at the time, I sent a letter to Walt Disney Pictures to make a Phineas and Ferb movie for movie theaters. If you know me for a while, you guys know I love Phineas and Ferb. That show has changed my life forever. And I have a lot of merchandise, which I'll be showing them when at the morning when I wake up. That'll be awesome. And I cannot wait until 2017 to turn this show 10 years old. And once 2017 comes, which I'll be 23 and going to be an adult, I will call this show an iconic Disney animated TV show classic that marked my teenage years that I watched non-stop when I was at teen, in my teenage life. And today, we have two weeks until my most anticipated movie of 2011 that I'm going to see on day release on opening day in the cinema, in the big screen with the audience. And I want my sphere of face and focus to be teenagers and adults who love the show and not kids. I just cannot wait to see this film on day release. It's going to be amazing. I'm going to do the biggest vlog of that film on my channel in that day. I cannot wait. I cannot believe that four years ago, this show became popular. I first discovered that they're making a new Disney show when they finished it for back in 2006. I said to myself, this looks cool. I want to watch it. I want to watch it. But then in June 2007, when I heard the show's coming in 2008, I said to myself, oh man, I had to wait. But thankfully, in August 2007, I saw a YouTube video about Phineas and for the first episode, I click on it, I loved it. I said to myself, this might be my new favorite show of all time. And I just cannot believe, guys, that today, we got two weeks away for the theoretical release in my area to Phineas and for the movie Across the Second Dimension. I just cannot wait to see the film theaters on opening day in two weeks, you guys. This is going to be like one of the best Disney movies I am going to watch in my life. And I'm so happy that this movie got praised by fans of Phineas and Ferb calling it the best Disney Channel original movie in years. That is summer awesome. Grrr. I'm so happy that this show turned four years old. Which It's been a ride, guys. It's been a ride. And speaking of the show, I binge watching most of the episodes on Disney Channel a lot of times in the summer. Which that is amazing. And I watched the show a lot this year. And, and I become a fan of the show even more to think about it. And I'm watching most of the episodes before I go see the movie in theaters on August 31st. 
And I will do a review on Across the Second Dimension, hopefully in the day when I, first, when I see the film in theaters. And I will do the biggest vlog of the film on my channel yet next to read. So yeah, happy fourth anniversary to one of my favorite shows of all time. A toast to Phineas and Fur for the fourth anniversary. And when I get older, when I'm on my 30s or mid 30s, I will be with my kids. If I have kids, I will show them Phineas and Ferb and I will like, kids, I'm going to show my favorite decision when I was a teenager. This masterpiece, just show, watch it, it's so good. Or when I go have kids, when I rewatch Phineas and Ferb, I will like, I remember this show. This was one of my favorite shows back in the day. It brings me back so good memories watching this show every day. Thank you so much for the fourth anniversary of Phineas and Ferb. And best of all, Phineas, Wanna go to Alakane with me to celebrate your show's anniversary? Yes, I am, Alex. Hey, where's Perry? Oh, there you are, Perry. And bye.